फ्रेंड्स 450 डेज ऑफ वॉर नेटो इज ओपेली प्रिपेयरिंग वॉर विथ रशिया एज पर द रिपोर्ट द समिट इन विलिनियस विच इज प्रपोज टू बी ऑन 11 12 जुलाई नेटो विल अप्रूव ए डॉक्यूमेंट विच इट क्लेम्स इज नेसेसरी टू काउंटर रशियन अटैक बिकॉज द कॉन्फ्लिक्ट वुड ब्रेक आउट एट एनी मोमेंट coming to war zones in south on zaporizhia direction preparation for ukrainian spring offensive seems to be complete where their strong army close to 70000 are awaiting 80 to 90 kilometers from the battle line for the orders also the ukrainian engineering works were noticed on west bank of nipro river in many number of areas before the offensive starts it is expected that a barrage of artillery strikes uavs air interdiction will be carried out on russian forces position checkpoints command posts headquarters warehouses bases civilian parts related to russian forces before the major offensive in zaporizhia or even in kherson Crimea, Svetsa Pol, Sevastopol starts. In addition, distracting attack will be carried out probably on Belgorod region in north. In north, Ukrainian forces have increased massive shelling in Belgorod and adjacent areas, while on Kupiansk Liman direction through Kremina, the battle position or occasional limited attacks counter attacks are continuing coming to east where the war seems to be in motion however nothing much towards marinka or audivka direction but in bakhmut the pmc conquered another 400 meters and thus claims that less than 1% of the city or even One square kilometer is left with the Ukrainian forces. PMC took full control of Novi, that is Domino. Fight is on for the area of monument to MiG-17 aircraft. On flanks in south, the Russian forces further retreated several hundreds of meters towards Klitschivka direction. However, they claim that they are holding the dominant height. Krasnoye, that is Ivanovsky. holds towards soledar direction the ukrainian offensive made some more gains in bagdonivka khromov and even towards rihorivka region situation seems to be stable and positional battle is continuing even though the ukrainian counter offensive continues in the meantime huge air interdiction missions by the russian aerospace forces continues while all along the battle line the artillery rockets and other forms of interdiction mission which you can call shelling oblique bombing including uavs continues from both the sides some related information the top russian diplomat at un has said that russia reserves right to take any measure to neutralize threat from ukraine while cnn reports that us will not block export of f16 to ukraine now this proves only what initially i have said on many occasions that nato whether whether it wants or not is getting deeper inside with all forms of ammunitions and weapons inside ukrainian war this is an opportunity for the usa to be part of the war while being away f- far from the war zone physically as well as geographically an estimate says that us led war has killed 4.5 million since 9 by 11 this is given in washington post in addition to fight people have died due to consequences of the war like violence hunger destruction disease which has amounted close to 3.6 to 3.7 million and they are 
not directly because of war but because of indirect causes led by the USA well lastly one more thing it is very sure that the voices of the people globally is not heard by their representatives governments and the world is moving towards utter destruction due war and climate degradation that's all for the day thank you friends